Jen Dobra, everyone. Welcome to the Game Grid, and welcome to the first 10 minutes of Time Loader. A game that I've doesn't really have anything drink. to do with loading, and only marginally to do with time. We are going to see that in show cutscene later on during the actual playthrough, final because, test. spoilers, this is one of the games I'm going to be doing. Open functionality. So, Works this fine. little guy Great. is us. Grabbing functionality, also good. Got a fling. And you don't release both buttons, you only release right. Satisfactory. Could be better. It's better than before. Climb a thing. Climb. Climbing functionality. Oh. Excellent. That's enough. At least it should be. Yeah. Hang time functionality. Works fine. You, little one, have a very important job to do. I'm counting on you. Initiating time transfer. Here we go. Oops, you broke the microwave. Act one. Yeah, just like the pedestrian, this game isn't too long, so I can definitely time transfer complete. Successfully arrived the in wheels 1995. Fell. Local time? 10 a.m. We did it. Movement functionality is damaged. Need to find and reattach the missing wheels as soon as possible. Yeah. Okay, we are ready to go. Our primary goal is to find and destroy the red car. No car, no accident. Mm. According to my data, it should be downstairs in the living room. You sure that's gonna work properly? Looks like the keyboard didn't survive the repair job. Anyway, yeah, this game isn't too long of a thing, so I am going to be doing a playthrough of this one, too. Save energy, save the planet. Ooh, that computer did not survive much of anything, did it? Grab. Really weird looking rug kind of thing in the foreground. This game's got an interesting polygonal art style. You get used to it, it definitely looks cool. Up. Oh. Come on. Up, I say. Keep out. Every scientist needs some privacy. <laughs> Yeah, I can relate to that. I put a mitten on my door whenever I'm recording so that my parents don't go respecting your privacy by knocking, but setting my authority as a parent by coming in anyway. Seriously, I have had to scrap multiple recordings because of that. Oh, wait. Go left first. Hey, that's Adam's cat. It looks much bigger now. And not so friendly. Yeah, trust me, that cat is going to come into play a lot. And Look, not in a good car. way. Try to get to it. It's actually gonna come in a very sad way. But you guys will see that later on. Yeah, I may as well pre-reveal the plans now. Terra Nell is gonna finish, then I'll do the pedestrian, and then time loader. And there's probably gonna be other things in between too, but I don't want to overdo it. Great. Now we need to destroy it. Let's use the garbage disposal unit in the kitchen. Uh, you it helps to jump when you're launching some things. 
But yeah, do not release both buttons while throwing. You gotta keep the left mouse enabled and only release the right. Ah. Yeah, hang time functionality definitely needs some improvement on this little guy. As does jump height. But that'll come in play later. Grab. And to the kitchen. Oops. You know, now that I think about it, this almost has similar energy to Low Big Planet. It's a 3D-ish environment, but your limited movement on a 2D plane. Except here, you don't even have layers you can switch between. Alright, I'm gonna yeet. Great, the car is inside the disposal unit. We just gotta turn it on. Okay, but how do we get up there? Surely doing this won't mess up the past. Surely. Adam's mom is probably going to be thinking there's ghosts in the house. Button. Excellent. That should rewrite Adam's future. Running the divergence analysis. Oh no, who's this kid and why did he fall off a thing? Just got back to the future. Electro boom! No! Huh? The circumstance has changed, but the turning point is still the same. We should keep trying. If we get to the basement, we should be able to shut down the electricity. Come on, I'll Maybe. show you the way. Why would there even be a loose power line on the thing anyway? That's the real question. Back to the living room. Oh, it looks cute while sleeping. We shouldn't wake it up. Yeah. You don't have to move this thing, it's just fun to. Are you? Is that a singing bass on the wall? Weird looking logs. Quite a convenient environment we've got here, huh? Cactus is in the way. Grab? Up. Oh, this cactus is in the way. Maybe we can move it somehow. I thought I had the guy. Glass on the floor, those are definitely going to go smash. game Adam practically lived inside it <laughs> oh he had little hard eyes okay that's a shame oh will most likely get upset he loved this robot darn May 1995. 
Come on. Get equipped with screwdriver. screwdriver. 